Hey YouTube, it's Lego Tech Note here, and today I will be showing you how to get a Game Boy Advance or Game Boy Color emulator on your iPod Touch, iPhone, or iPad. Now, first of all, what you will need is to have a jailbroken iDevice on uh, iOS 4 or over. Um, I'm not 100% sure about iOS 3 or iOS 2, um, but I'm pretty sure it's just iOS 4 and over. So, um, uh, yeah, let's get into it. Alright, so first of all, what you're going to get is your iDevice, and you're going to um, unlock it and go into Cydia. So mine's a bit laggy, sorry about the lag. Alright, so I'm just going to go into Cydia here, and once it has loaded, so it'll just say set to load. Um, you're going to want to add the source, so you're going to manage, sources, edit, and add. You're going to want to add the source, insanely I, I'll just show you, in, insanely I, dot repo, but um, I'll have the source in the description anyway. Um, so you can get it from that source, or you can get it from the Excelize source, which I'll also have in the description, or you can get it from the Zod TTD and Mac City source. So once you've added uh, whichever source you would prefer, you just go into search, and you search up GPS phone. So what you're going to want to get is the one with the question mark as the little icon. So just show you that there. Um, if you do want to get the one from Exalize, it's a bit um, more complicated. You have to get the GPS phone and the BIOS. Um, and then install all of that. Both of those things, but if you just want to get it from the Insane AI for free, it will be in just GPS phone. Now, if you want to pay for this, it is in the Zod TDD and Mac City source. So, anything in ever in blue in Cydia, it means that you have to pay for it. So, um, I'm just going to go into the GPS phone from the Insane AI source, and because I've already installed it, it says modify. But for you, it's going to say install right there. So you're just going to hit that install button and then hit confirm. And your device, I, it probably won't respring. But um, once it has installed, you want to get out of Cydia. And you will have a little icon that says GPS phone. So just let that load up. And you will have all of these games. So, um, you get uh, Super Mario Bros. 2 Advanced, well, Mario Advanced 2, 3, and 4, Mario, oh, a whole lot of Mario ROMs. And then you will get some more ROMs like Grand Theft Auto, Kingdom Hearts, Legend of Zelda, and some Pokemon ones there. Now, uh, once you've going into it you just want to hit a random uh, well not really random but whatever game you actually want to play and you just touch it uh, tap it and you go portrait and sound or landscape and sound or portrait no sound landscape no sound now um if you don't have your headphones in it will not be on sound okay if you hit the sound one but a tip to do that is if you want to have it just from your speakers and not in your headphones you plug in your headphones first into the headphone jack and then you take them out once you've already launched the game in sound and it will be running off your speakers so um, I'll just go landscape and sound here and it's not gonna have any sound but um yeah you get you get the point and then just whatever and yeah so just made a new game on Mario but yeah uh, but what is gonna happen is if you quit to the menu from one game um, you can either save it or whatever 
I'm just not going to save it. You can't launch another game without, well normally, you can't launch another game without the app crashing. Sometimes it will um, not crash and others it will crash. So um, yeah, uh, if you want to get more ROMs, if you want to get more ROMs just go into Cydia and from the XLI source or from the Insanely I source you can get more ROMs. So I'll just wait for Cydia to load here, and I'll go into Manage, and I'll go into, well, I won't even go into Manage, I'll just search, like, if you want to get, um, some Mario ROMs, or Pokemon ROMs, just search up in that search bar once you have XLIs and Insanely I, um, you just want to search up, like, so, say I want to get Mario ROMs, I'll just go, Mario... ROMs, oh sorry, ROMs, just tap that, go install, and then, um, I'm good to go, but yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to get a Game Boy Advanced or Game Boy Color emulator for your iPod Touch, iPhone, or iPad, and remember to rate, comment, and subscribe, and this has been a tutorial from the LEGO Tech Nerd, and yeah. So, see ya.